All right, we're going to talk about some matrices. Uh, first, we're going to talk about basic matrix operations, adding, subtracting, scalar multiplication. Then we'll talk about multiplying matrices. So what is a matrix? Um, a matrix is a way of categorizing numbers into rows and columns so that it takes up a little less space. You don't have to always say what we're talking about, be it sophomores, juniors, seniors, boys, girls, however you're categorizing it. And we have dimensions, a dimension of a matrix, and you always say rows by columns. So this has one, two rows, and one, two, three columns. Rows go left to right, just like you write in rows, and columns, just like columns on a building, columns that hold up buildings go up and down. So adding matrices. Each one of these numbers corresponds to a specific, like I said, sophomore males or something. And so you're always going to add the corresponding parts. So top left, top left, top right, top right. Just add the parts together. It's very, really quite simple. Um, and same thing, if you want to subtract, let's just subtract the corresponding parts. A minus E, B minus F, so on and so forth. Note they must be identical in order to have corresponding parts to add or subtract. Um, if you want to scale something up or scale something down, um, in this case we're, we have a scalar, spelled like that, 5 being multiplied out front. All you have to do is multiply every single number on the inside by 5. So 5 times 4, 5 times 5, 5 times negative 1, 5 times 3, 5 times 0, and 5 times negative 3. That is scalar. And next example, subtract. So just be careful when you subtract because it's going to be negative 2 minus a negative 3. And so what I like to do is I just go through to forget about the negative minusing a negative. I actually just, let's change all these signs. That'll be adding, and that'll be subtracting. So negative 2 plus a 3 is 1. 5 plus 5 is 10. 11 plus 4, 4 plus a negative 2. Negative 6 plus a negative 7, that's negative 13, becoming more negative. 8 and negative 10 is negative 2. So subtracting matrices, just make sure that you distribute that minus sign to all of those because all of them need to be subtracted. Be careful with subtracting negatives that whole bit. Um, so this one, all we have different here is we have a scalar and then these two added together. Just like with order of operations, you want to take care of the scalar unless there were parentheses here. You want to take care of the scalar first. So we get negative 3, 3 times negative 1, 3 times 2 is 6, 3 times 0, 3 times negative 5, and add to that 2, negative 7, 6, and 3. So negative 3 and 2 make a negative 1, 6 and negative 7 make a negative 1, 0 and 6, and negative 15 and 3 make negative 12. All those corresponding parts is all you're going to add. And that is matrix addition. Now, matrix multiplication, a little trickier. And so we'll move on to the next vid. Yo.